Yo, this is crazy, man. I quit my job. I, I quit my job, guys. Like, wow. I quit. <laughs> I exist in all dimensions. Flesh bound. The stale money from the mattress bought a fresh pound. Leather on the steering wheel, it got my palm chilly. All right, what's up, guys? This is another vlog, another day in the life of Corey Jones, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully, y'all have been watching my videos that I've been dropping recently, been very open, been very transparent. So I know some of you all are probably new here from some of those videos because they're doing pretty well. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for being here. And welcome to a vlog. Oh, 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 make sure you check out Scotch Porter beard products, you know what I'm saying? This is what I use on my beard, you know? My beer wouldn't be the way it is without Scotch Porter, so make sure you check out Scotch Porter beer products. The link will be in the description below. But of course, I use all of their beer products from the beer serum, from the beer balm here, the beer conditioner, the beer wash, the leave in. Like, I use all of it. That's how I get this beer looking good, y'all. You know what I'm saying? If y'all wanna know, right now I am vlogging on my Sony. ZV1. I love the Sony ZV1. I know a lot of y'all are trying to become content creators be wondering what you need in order to vlog, what you need in order, you know, to start your YouTube channel. I really think I can get away with a Sony ZV1 throughout my whole YouTube channel. Like, I don't even need my bear camera right here. If I can get it. I feel like I don't even need this. Like, this right here is the Canon EOS R. This is what I use for my primary YouTube channel and stuff. But I really feel like I don't need this. The Sony ZV-1 looks nice. I mean, y'all let me know. And then it got product showcase. Like, so if I put this in, it instantly, and then I instantly get back in focus, like quick. It don't even take time. Like, y'all see that? It's perfect, bro. Like, Canon, EOS RP, it's a good camera, but the Sony ZV-1. But yeah, I'm glad y'all are following me. We gonna, you know, do some things, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna tell y'all what's my next moves and everything like that, because I know y'all probably like, what, what, what you doing now that you gonna quit your job? What are you doing? Well, I'm actually about to take a walk in the park. So as I'm taking this walk in the park, I'm taking you all with me and then I will explain. My behind keep forgetting stuff I forgot. I can't go nowhere without my, I can't go nowhere without my Apple Watch. I keep forgetting like, I like to track. My beard can be in the public without the beard picked out, you know what I'm saying? It's a little, it's a little chilly today. I guess it's about that time of the year. Fall time. Yo, I forgot to show y'all, I have this new wallet. This right here, and I have an AirTag, Apple AirTag, just in case I lose it, but this wallet is cool because I press this button right here Boom, cards pop up just like that. Quick with it. Like, it's the little things. And it fold out like this too. I'm actually about to stop and get some coffee. But this is what it feels like to not be working during a weekday, like to not have a job. Content creators could just go out and do whatever. This is, this is crazy, man. So yeah, I'm about to get some coffee, answer some emails, and I really don't know what to do with my life right now. Oh, these are not shades. I'm gonna shade these right now. Here we go. Yeah, I really, really don't know what to do with my life right now. right now so I'm just about to go through a mass like and answer to some of these comments because there's a whole bunch on here so I appreciate y'all who comment I appreciate y'all who like support your boy yeah this is one of my favorite coffee spots Spiller Spiller Park sometimes it's kind of awkward to vlog in public because people are looking at you like these people right here is looking at me talking to the camera 
But sometimes you just you just gotta do what you gotta do. They're not looking at you because you're doing something wrong. They're looking at you because they're like, is this guy a YouTuber or, or what's going on? So I know some people that uh, that I be trying to talk to a coach be saying that they are scared to vlog in person. And, you know, it, it takes some courage, I will tell you that. I promised my mom that I would call her back. She texted me last night and I was like, I'm gonna call you tomorrow. So let me call her before I forget because she will get on me. favorite parks in Atlanta um, love it out here it's very tranquil very very peaceful um, not many people know about this park I think it's called Meadow Park or something like that it's not one of the big parks because it's like a trail and you walk and you walk and you walk oh shoot it must have, oh yeah it was raining so it's a little muddy out here but yeah you just walk and they uh they be having like little league baseball out here. Um, I know. Everybody say hey to you when you're walking by, but I love it out here, man. When we actually get to the trail trail, you will see like the, the meat and potatoes of this trail. Like I love it. And it also goes all the way down to um, Emory, Emory University. This is the type of weather I like. This is the type of weather that make me want to be outside even though I love when it's warm but like 70 degrees a nice little breeze you can't beat that y'all you cannot beat that hopefully y'all have been tuned in to my recent videos you know my recent videos uh, you know trying to provide more transparency trying to be more vulnerable even though I have been on this channel but you know there's always more that you can do so you know hopefully these stories and and you know what I've overcame and how I've become the man that I that I am today is inspiring you all to do the same you know be more transparent be more open male and females you know what I'm saying get things off your chest share your stories because you never know what stories or what you say or what you've been through can help other people you know that's the purpose of this platform is to help other people um, inspire and yeah I mean you just never know but um oh, what is this right here that ain't good I'm glad I looked down cuz uh your boy's about to go all the way up in there I ain't lying but I know most of y'all are here because I said I quit my job you know what I'm saying so whenever we get closer to a spot where I can like plop down sit down real quick I'm explain that to you all but we gonna get there we gonna get there I want to take a stop at my favorite part of this this trail if it's not taken up already because a lot of people like to stop at that particular spot I don't know if I could live in a house that's on water like that maybe like a vacation home or something temporary but Primarily, I just know snakes and reptiles and all kind of stuff like that being their backyards and stuff, and I ain't got time for that. Even though I'm from South Carolina, technically a country boy, I done seen snakes and stuff like that before. I had rabbits in the backyard and had snapping turtles around, snakes. I done seen it all. But that don't mean I want to live with that shit. <laughs> they got little side trails here that you could take too, but I ain't never tried to do none of that because you know, us black folk, we like to be adventurous, you know. We like to be adventurous, but we ain't trying to go off away from the path that's meant to be, you know, walked on. Wow. I came out here to get to my little spot. Nigga can't even go to the spot. Like, what the hell? Under construction. Detour, follow, flagging. Short detour, stale, steep. I guess we're gonna have to follow this right here. I don't know. Oh Lord. Yo, I don't know where the thing taking me. But it's ain't follow the flagging. Oh shit. Oh. I said I wasn't gonna do this. 
now your boy doing this but i'm only doing this for y'all because i want to show y'all my spot made it we made it to spot number one guys look at this it's, oh almost twist my ankle just now it's beautiful out here it is beautiful out here Long bridge, nice little bridge. People put little locks out here, I guess to commemorate or remember when they met and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, this path goes several ways. You can go this way to get to Emory. You go back that way to get to the main road and some um, tennis courts. Like this trail is legit. I kind of want to jump this right here because I need to go back that way to get to where I'm trying to go. But I'm going to go around. I'm going to loop. I'm going to loop around. All right, so basically this is what's going on. I quit my job, right? So I put in my two weeks notice. And I was like, yo, I'm... I'm moving, I'm, I'm switching gears, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes when you've been working somewhere, I've been there going on two and a half, three years. Um, so sometimes when you're working somewhere and you don't see potential growth or you don't see opportunity or you don't see like in your future where you could, you know, grow and become something that you always seen yourself becoming, it's time to make that move, it's time to make that switch, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I love my past company, great company, great people, very diverse, but you gotta look out for yourself at the end of the day. You can't really let a job hold you in just because they treat you well, just because the people are nice. Like, when you reach a certain period or time point in your life or in your career, you know, you're gonna wanna make more, you're gonna wanna grow, you wanna gonna want new challenges. And, you know, unfortunately that, didn't come for me with my you know last job so you know if you know you know if you don't you don't if you don't know where i work probably could look it up anyway but i worked at a technology consulting company i just said i worked at a center if you know what a center is <laughs> but great company i would recommend anyone to you know work there um but now you know i was like i was like yeah i need to get up out of here i need to try something new and you know on linkedin you know, a couple of recruiters reached out to me from Apple, Google, Microsoft, Shopify. It's been a lot of companies that reached out. So I started taking conversations. I started taking, you know, those introductory conversations to see if this is an opportunity that I would want. And, you know, took a few of them, but, you know, landed on interviewing with Google, you know. Um, and that's where I'm going to be at next. I'm, I'm going to be working at Google, guys, starting in a couple of weeks. That's where I'm going to be at and you know I'm excited about this new opportunity, excited about this opportunity to grow and work for a company like Google, bring diversity to their organization. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be working at Google. I'm pretty sure some of you all thought I was just quitting and starting my own, my own thing, but nah, nah. I'm the type of person where I enjoy uh, having multiple streams of income, so I'm not the type of person that's wanting to let go of my 9 to 5 right now. I'm more interested in stacking money, saving money, having multiple streams of income, and then making that move when I feel comfortable and safe to just drop my nine to five and then just go into more so of a, um, and just, just drop my nine to five and go more into um, content creation full time. These people just came and interrupted me. They sat right next to me on the bench I don't know why, but they did, and it just messed up my whole flow of thinking and everything like that. So now I'm walking and talking. So back to walking and talking. But anyway, yeah, I'm you know I'm trying to you know keep my nine to fives, still do content creation, still have multiple streams of revenue. Um, I'm not trying to you know go full time content creation, uh, especially right now. Sometimes you got to be real with yourself and 
No, I'm not ready for that. I'm not ready for that. And yeah, definitely excited about the opportunity, but thank you all for rocking with me. I appreciate it so much. And go ahead and leave a like, subscribe, share the videos if you haven't already. And yeah, man, I'm gonna catch y'all in the next video. Peace. I exist in all dimensions. Flesh bound, flesh bound. stale money from the mattress, bought a fresh pound. Fresh pound. Leather on the steering wheel, it got my palm chilly. Short necklace with a long willy calm, really. And it ain't even about the fame, it's about the bread. Lost. The intern, shorty, take me to the boss.